Hey everyone, it's Chris Tex here. Let's play another game of the Seafarers of Catan on Colonists. We are playing in the number third spot. Let's take a look at the rules of this board. It is to 14 points. We are playing the Treasure Island. For those of you who don't know, there is one extra victory point for settling on any of these little islands. In addition, you get all kinds of fun treasures when you go to those islands. This is one of those that Kind of an interesting board. I tend to not explore as much as a lot of players do. I do tend to stay on the uh, the main island for the most part. Um, it really does kind of depend on a number of things. So in this case, oh, you see, like this player already going for the uh, already going for the for the quick. <laughs> For the, the quick sale in there. Certainly interesting. We got some options here. You gotta be careful with that cheap port though. That may or may not work out well for them. But we've got some options here. Um, I wonder if we bother exploring. There's some nice spots. Could do this 843, could do this 8410. Kind of like this idea going after this ore port, to tell you the truth. That could be pretty nice. Uh, I do think this person might go take that, though, if I went there. So we got to be a little bit careful with our placements. There's a lot of sheep in here. Could do a really heavy sheep port strategy, I guess. That could work. Don't love that. I don't mind going out and getting some of this wood, though. It could be pretty useful for us. Definitely like this. Definitely like this. Um, kind of decide here. Do we take the production? Go 843, 8410? I kind of like that. Um, I'm going to do it. I'm going to go double, double strong ore here. Maybe a little controversial. We'll see. Um, I'm okay with it. Taking up a lot of that heavy ore spots. I'm cool with it. Let's do it. We'll work our way to the city. 1-8 gets us a city immediately. We kind of like that. Gets us strong production. <clears throat> okay, this guy gets the free ship. That's not a bad idea. They're going to be exploring quite a bit. So, going to want to watch out for Gray. Now, again, this really kind of depends. That really can be a very effective strategy. Um, but we'll see. Yeah, not a shock that they went there. Probably take the ship. Yeah, and that's that's okay. I don't mind that. Um, I do think we're going to be in pretty decent shape no matter what. Probably in a good card building. There's the eight. So certainly what we want. Love that. So we're going to be in good position. <clears throat> Excuse me. Good position. Good wheat position. We'll cut off the six as soon as possible. We do want to probably focus on this player. Shutting them down, because if they get a little too far ahead exploring, ooh, that's really good. This could get out of hand pretty quick. Um, and obviously, we prefer being... We're a little little different in the way we like to do this. So, we're hoping for a 7 here. Didn't get it. Really want to shut off them from getting over here. <clears throat> um, I will take my city. Already on the board there. Love that. All right, they already get a wood, too. They already might have a settle. Look at this, another gold mine. Wow. Two gold mines found. I think that's usually it. There might be one more. I think there's only two on, on the uh, Treasure Island. So they already found them all. That's pretty rare. Um, usually it takes a little while. Um, so really curious to see what happens here. But these guys are in a pretty good start. I think we're still in pretty good shape. Would love to get to this port. I went up to get some access to this wood and potentially get to this sheep port. Um, then maybe get to one of these two islands. I think that would be pretty nice for us. Uh, even this giant field of brick could be interesting. So I figured this was worth it to try to risk getting to the ore port just in case. Because then this, this player had an option maybe go 5, 10, 9, get that extra production there. They chose not to, and that's fine. Uh, really hoping that the great player is still with us. That would be really unfortunate because, again, they have a really good start. Um, yeah, and they are. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, this, this is going to be interesting to see what they wind up doing. Oh, they wind up moving their ship. Okay, I thought they would have gone over here for sure. 
Okay. Okay. Oh, there they go. Doing all the exploring. Interesting. I would have thought they would have just taken the uh, extra explorer thing. This this is where this gets really powerful, right? So kudos to them. They're doing a really good job moving around. We're not getting any rules right now, unfortunately. That's another turn without anything. Now, I guess the problem with this strategy is they just don't have a lot of production yet. That could change. Let's see, they get like this four five going. Another five. And these rolls keep going. Obviously, that's the the brown player. Still, still could be pretty groovy for them. And yeah, they don't get much there, but probably good enough for a settle. But there's an eight. That's super nice. We'll take all that brick. Would love like a four here. Or even another seven would be pretty swell, to tell you the truth. We get a nine. Nothing doing. We're going to pass. Yeah, just waiting at this point. I need some rolls. I need these fours to roll. There we go. Finally. Needed a four. Really need that four. Because soon we could start trading ore four for one to get some wood and start moving. Which would really be really beneficial. Three is nice here. I like that. Could double city here. It's certainly an option. Because we're going to have to keep up with this, this lady here soon. This is going to get out of control again if she keeps going. Yeah. Gets another card too, because they're already way ahead of the cards. That's that's kind of the wild card with the Treasure Islands. You get the cards. It's really nice. It hasn't been a single seven yet, which is actually really annoying. Um, yeah, getting everything. So she's going to want to settle here eventually. Guess not. Okay. No sevens. Wow. Again, I was really hoping uh, we would just take this and attack there. Um, I think this kind of forces me to go buy a card, to tell you the truth. I can't risk them just controlling the board here. So I'm going to go double card. <clears throat> Try to combat them a little bit. So I don't want them getting the army and the road. So I think that's a pretty good idea in the early going here. And obviously, brown isn't really going to be that much help, unfortunately. Yeah, I like the eights. Okay, there's a knight. Hits us there. That doesn't hurt me too badly, but it is annoying. Um, I am going to strike. Hit here. We're going to hit the gray player. Get a sheep, which is really nice. And we get a four, which is actually perfect. We're actually going to get two more cards, which I really like. So we're actually going to be ahead of them on the cards. So we do need to stay ahead. So we're in really good position here at the moment. Um, we can certainly beat them in a card war, I think, just because our production is so much better. So unless they've got some monopolies in there, which is completely possible, I am liking our position at the moment. Yeah, don't want to trade it with brick. I would do wood. Uh, nah, they need wood too. Yeah, there's not a lot of wood out there. So again, this is where taking this production is important. I'm okay with slow going slow here. Hmm, they didn't have anything, which is sweet. Let's see if they move a ship. They do. All right, they're gonna okay, good. They actually have a year of plenty. They're gonna get the settle. Or are they going to move a ship and then sell? Yeah, okay. We want to cut off access to this, if possible. Okay, that's fine. Um, we're going to roll. There's no reason not to. Eight. They didn't get anything. And I think now is a good time to build that other city, to tell you the truth. Um, since we're going to pick our spots on these knights really think that's a good plan. This player is in really good position. Obviously, they can come right in here, do what they need to do, settle, settle. But they're going to need, they're obviously going to need some uh, ore to really get going here, which they don't have yet. So I think for now, we're in okay shape. We're really hoping like an 11 rolls. Maybe we can rob some of that from this person. They do have this nice four coordination. So that's the one rule we don't want. We don't want them to get a four. So four rules, they can get another ship, get this, in which case, not much I can do. Hmm. 
So let's see. I, I am kind of wishing I... Oh, nice. I'm kind of wishing I pushed this this way, though. That is my one little regret here. They have nothing. Take that. Oh, they did have something. Where did that come from? Where, where did that come from? Wait a minute. Oh, they got the treasure. Oh, they moved a ship. I see. Okay, that's fine. Um, I'm going to play a knight. I'm going to move this. We'll take that and we'll roll. Perfect. All right. I'm going to go four for one, get the road. And I'm going to head to this. Uh, hmm. Interesting. Do I go nine, ten, three and take all this production or go eight, three? Hmm. Hmm. That's an interesting question. Um. Hmm. I don't really consider this, to tell you the truth. Could do that. Yeah, you know what? Let's do that. Maybe I should go to the sea here, but you know, I don't know. I like this all this production. It's really not bad, especially if we get all this this ore here, continually getting it. We can keep buying cards, keep putting pressure. Okay, that actually worked out, because they, they definitely could have come in here if they had the road builder, so I'm not upset about that. Love this on this six. That's really going to help us out. We got them stuck here. Uh, the ship robber is not a threat to us, because we're not on the sea. So I like that. Yeah, and these two are basically going to have a ship war, and we're going to be on land doing our own thing, so... Yeah, I'll, I'll take it. Look at this. There they go. Especially with us controlling the knights here. Other block. Really, really strong on that six block. So yeah, that's really helping us. And again, I'm in no pressure to play these. Another six blocked again. Um, I'm going to hold. I see no reason to help anybody, no reason to do much. We're just gonna we're just gonna sit. Alright, we get the seven here. Ooh, hits the four, hits them though, which I'm happy about. That's fine. It's gonna come right back at that six. That four is probably her best roll. But really it's the six I don't wanna see. Another road builder, wow. Double, that's kind of, that's a little unlucky for them. Yeah, I think this becomes the, the spot anyway. Because here's the thing, right? They, they can keep exploring, that's all good. I'm actually kind of fortunate this is all available. Maybe I actually should have gone here in retrospect. Because this is still open. Um, but yeah, I'm not exactly upset about this. We get a seven. I wonder if they move the ship robber. Maybe it goes on the 8, actually. Let's see. Ooh, that's an interesting choice. All right, it's coming right back. Go in here. Go in here. Make the brick. Rolling. Nice. Now, they do get a 4, which is a little bit of a bummer. Um, but we get a lot of goodies here. I'm going to I'm going to go buy my goodies. There's no more road builders left, which is kind of a nice thing to know. And there is one less year of plenty, which is also kind of nice. You just got a VP. I think this might be a VP. So that's certainly worth keeping tabs on. It's a little annoying. That's fine. Another seven. Oh, well, this might be the ship robber moving here. Interesting. It's weird to me that she doesn't care about the ship. I would have thought they would have cared, but they don't. At this. Hmm. Um, hit you again. Got that war back. Nice. Roll. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> we're being we're being super annoying uh blocking the six constantly they do not like that at all um so i'm happy about that the less they like this the better love it now i'm gonna want to keep tabs on that 
All right, there's some sheep and wheat here. Something for us to consider, another card, that's fine. Let's roll. All right, we get an eight. What do we do with that? Do we buy another card? They don't have any access to brick. Um, might actually be nice to port that for the wood. The problem is, hmm. Yeah, you know what? I'm, I'm going to go port it for a card here. Why not? Why not? Honestly, I'm almost okay buying out the deck. Like, I need to make sure I can lock the army down. We're basically there. Um, but I think that's important. I really need some monopolies. That's what I'm really looking for. If I can fish the monopolies out of this deck, that would be awesome. Would love that. And again, I'm in better card buying position than these guys. But if they have the monopolies, that, that's a big problem. I really cannot have that. Hmm. Especially if they're going to keep buying cards. Yeah. Okay, another night. It does get a brick there. Oh, I get the brick right back. So that works out. Okay. It's coming right back. I'm actually going to hit you this time. Roll. Blocked again. Man, we've done a good job shutting down that six. That is pretty sweet. I gotta say, that is pretty... Oh, there's the wood, finally. Jeez, I'm waiting for that wood for like a million years. Okay. Okay. They finally take the, the road. They needed it, too. see what happens here yeah part of my problem is I'm, a, I'm i'm very slow here and they're really starting to get big so we really got to worry about them they already got the, the road i think i can effectively worry about this player a little bit less i think we really need to focus on this six make sure that does not go anywhere keep buying cards where possible yeah it's a little bit of a mistake to me why not put it here or here and then just have the road and the or the ship and the thing there. I think that's a bit of a mistake. Okay. Um, I'm actually gonna hold. I'm gonna hold here. All right. We're gonna we're gonna find out if there's a monopoly here real soon because I think if they mono, they mono for this. And they do. All right. Mono for the ore. Not a surprise. Yeah. Which is unfortunate, but. You know, with that ore port, yeah. It is a bit of a problem. Again, not unexpected. But the good news is they don't have any wheat, so they have to port it all. They get there, yeah, now they get this stuff. This is starting to get a little scary. So, really have to look out for this stupid brown player. And this is where our lack of ports and expansion is really starting to hurt. Right? I just don't have it. So, at least he can't go anywhere else, so that's good. Six. Blocked again. And again, I'm content leaving it on this six, like, forever. Uh, so, don't love that. Okay. Steals from me, gets a sheep. Doesn't have really any help. Okay, this is going right back on the six. Till the end of time. And again, I really need a Monopoly. I really need a Year of Plenty. Fortunately, we know there's one less Monopoly. So hopefully there's one more Monopoly in there. Because unfortunately, we're going to get out outproduced here. This is a big problem. We're going to get outproduced here relatively soon. Um, unless we build this and get over here. I, I am thinking this was actually probably the better move. I really think I should have pointed this road to the south and just ignored this wood spot that I thought may or may not be a thing. So, <clears throat> is what it is. It's 10 cards left. Okay. Move this ship, man. Come on. Yeah, it, I don't hate that. Moving this again. 
get a sheep there. I really hope for a wood. Didn't get it. We got a four though. Okay, that's important because that is going to get me a settle. And I'm I'm going to take it. I need I need the other spot. I'm going to take that settle. That opens up a nine for me. It opens up another ten. Oh, there's the wood too. Damn. Because again, this is another point potentially. But then I really need to get over here, potentially get to this island or this island. Again, this is where I think I did make a mistake. Um, because again, this 3.1 port now is really looking really good. But okay, they want to keep roading. I mean, that's fine. And we know what they're going to do. Settle, it's nine, settle 11, settle 13. And then this, this doesn't really matter because they already have it. Okay. Let's roll. An eight. Nice. That's also pretty important. Um, it gets me another card. I'm going to take the card. I'm going to buy a card. I like the victory point. That's nice. We get the city. We're 10. So we either need three more victory points. Again, pretty sure she's got one. So I think that's out of the cards. He might have an he might have one as well. That four is a good roll for her. Yeah. But I need to get over here. So I really need this eight to really kind of go off here. Thankfully, it's been going off most of the game. But if I get another eight over here, it's two more cards or it's a road. Okay, there's nine. That's probably a VP. So he probably just needs two settlements. That's it. So we're on a bit of a clock, right? At least he doesn't have any wheat. So he's got to port it, which is nice. But we're kind of playing defense unless we can, unless we can take it, you know? Could buy four cards with an eight. That'd be kind of neat. City there, okay. Seven, bummer. Okay. Perfect. All right, we'll take that from them. Let's go. It's one less card. It was actually a card that they needed, too. They needed that wheat. So that doesn't exactly make me feel bad. It's a cat. Cat's always coming in here in the middle of the night. Sneaking up on us. And where'd this go? What on the four hit her? Okay. Again, if it hits this eight, that's not the worst thing. Oh, I think you gotta steal from, from Brown, though. Okay, you know, that doesn't kill me. Gets me cards, which again, I like. Night. And a year plenty. Okay. Okay, we'll take that. Year plenty could be super important here. He doesn't really need the brick. It's not going to do him a lot of good. Yeah, moves the ship. Yeah, as far as I'm concerned, it's moving back on the six. Okay. Because again, this doesn't do him a lot of good. If he gets to this, it does. Eight's fine. We're going to knight here. Going to hit the six. Going to hit you. Get a sheep, which is very good. We get a three, which is really good, because that really helps us here. Um, you know, I'm going to go get another card. This rate, I don't think it's bad. We have this knight. Oh, there it is. Perfect. OK, now I'm feeling really good. That is really what we wanted. Um, so I think it's victory, victory point, victory point, victory point. We know those are hanging around. I got this. That makes me feel real good inside. And really, we're just waiting to mono for whatever big thing these guys need. Uh, that's what we're looking for. Got my year plenty. I was hoping for a four here. 
Get a seven. Hmm. Hit here. We'll take that. Do a year of plenty here. Yes. Let me go double wood. Let me go to the C. We'll pass. Really liking this. We're in good shape. 7-0. There's a risk we lose our wood. But it's okay. Maybe I should have bought a card in this situation. But, you know, I'm feeling okay. Again, got the mono. That's fine. That's a strange, strange play. But I get it. He wants to go here. I get it. Maybe get the card. Locked again, though. And he's out of he's out of ships. Does he have another ship? Where are his ships? He's got no more ships, so he actually can't get to there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 15. Yeah, he's out of ships. He actually can't get there. Actually pretty groovy. Really like that. Locked again. Man, I don't I don't think they've had that six the entire game. This I'll say this. This this is a pretty good game here. For us to control what we need to do. And I'm really, I'm really loving what we're doing. We are really causing some chaos uh, with these sixes. With all these knights we've had. Now there's still another victory point in this deck. Which could actually be really helpful to us. Um well, force huge. Unfortunately. He did block our, our sheep there, uh, which is kind of a bummer. Let's see what she gets. That that four for her is really big. I'm just going for the city, okay? Okay, gets her city. Now f it really did hurt. Um, Ten. Okay. All right. A lot of brick. Hmm. Only three brick. I think we hold. And I think we build our settle. Which again, I think is important. All right. There's a ton of brick out there. We know that. Another ten. Even more brick. So really watching this brick. It's got six of it. Maybe he trades it for something. We're going to find out. He does. Trades it for a wood. So he trades it for one card. And again, we're we're on watch here, right? Now, I'm hoping this isn't gonna matter, but we're gonna find out pretty pretty soon. Again, we're we're in a bit of a desperate spot. I think this goes back in the eight. Oh, interesting. That is a mistake, I think. Okay, well, you know, it is what it is. We look more powerful, I think, than we are. Um, and that is hurting us a little bit. Um, hmm. What do I want to do about this? There's a lot of brick. I'm going to go for the road here. I think I settle city and then try to pull for the card i think that's the current plan we try to beat brown here it's a big roll because he can port that for whatever he needs and he does sheep settle it's getting close it's getting close Man. Yeah, okay, so they're one settle away from winning it. Okay. Lots of brick. Look at all that brick. Okay, like that. Five. Hmm. Don't love that. Um I think that forces us to mono to tell you the truth. 
I, do, I can't have this guy. Yeah, we have the mana. Mana for the bricks. All right, we needed that. Could use this to get a settle. I think we take the settle. Yeah, let's take the settle. All right, we're getting there. Unfortunately, I think this guy's going to be a little too fast for us. Partially because this person doesn't get it. Um, but we'll see. I think you move the ship here. Because I don't need the ship to win necessarily. See, I think that's a mistake. I Actually, I do think that's a mistake. Because um, why move it off? And I think that's a mistake. Like, if you only need the settle to win, just go for the settle, right? Like, I think that's all you really need. Like, I need to do more. That's my problem, right? I am a city and a card away. Yeah, I think, unfortunately, we're just a little too stretched out here. So, that is, it's going to hurt us. And I don't know there's much we can do about it. Yeah, because I think this is probably the gain here, unfortunately. I just don't think... I don't think I can really combat that, right? I'm actually going to put it here. Well... Let's put it there. Yeah. All right, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to hold. I think, I think Brown has it here. All right, maybe not yet, but they're really close. Because again, all they need is a settle. Or could get it for them, we'll see. Let's get all they need is a settle here. That They got it, they got it. Yeah, it's over. Yeah. Yeah, I, again, I don't think this lady realized that that was really close. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't quite pull it off. What's, what are they complaining about? Yeah, yeah, that was kind of the worry. Um, kind of weird the way this game transpired. I, I think there were some mistakes. Obviously, we, we made a mistake, I think. I think this was our mistake, right? Now, we didn't play bad. We only lost two. But I think we probably win this if, if we actually go... On our settle, we made a mistake, right? On a couple, I think on both of our roads, both were mistakes. I was thinking, decent chance maybe this is open that he goes here instead. Well, he took the free ship. Should have seen that coming. That's my bad. This port would have been a game changer. On this way, should have gone to the sea this way. Got one of these three for one ports. Would have been a game changer. Three for one port here would have been a huge difference. So we did make a mistake. Instead, we were like, oh, we'll get the wood. But then we just, we never even got the wood. So we made some mistakes there. Very poor road placements. I, I think our settlements were fine, but our our roads were wrong. Because um, again, I think we had a really good chance of winning this game. Oh, they actually did get the second VP. Yeah, so, yeah. Because again, we were just too slow to expand. And ultimately that is what hurt us. The fact that we were robbed 11 times too kind of sucks. Because I don't think this lady really realized that that they were the danger more than us. We probably should have said something. But again, I sometimes in seafarers, I, I just don't think it's worth it. But hey, that was fun. Didn't happen for us. It's okay. Uh, I think we're really going to try to get pretty serious in seafarers here pretty soon. I, I was thinking to myself, I'm like, what would be my next goal? Probably get to like top 30 in seafarers or something. So I'm going to be looking to do that pretty soon again. So hey, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.